Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Autos. In this video, I'll be showing you how to solve Terabox app network connection, no internet problem. But before we start, hurry up and check out the software just under this video. So let's get started. In this case, you might be wondering how do you solve this issue here on the Terabox app. Well, the first thing that you want to do here, which is the most obvious uh, thing that we could do, is to make sure that you have a pretty stable internet connection. In this case, you could go ahead and open up any browser here and just type in the following, which is going to be speed test, and just run a quick speed test here. Now, in this case, you need both your download and your upload speed here at, in this case, pretty good speed. Like, for example, mine is average here, so my download speed is going to be around 50, and my upload speed is actually around 30 to 40. So in this case, you want to go ahead and make sure to have a stable interconnection. Now, if your interconnection is the, uh, in this case, is quite uh, slow, it means that it is a problem here. You might want to consider switching to a different network or start using your mobile data. Now, if your interconnection is pretty good and you still have any problem, well, the thing here is you want to make sure that you have the latest version of the app. Now, if you don't have the latest version of the app, this will actually affect the functionalities and the uh, connectivity that you have to Terabox platform. In this case, you want to go open up Google Play Store here, and you want to look for Terabox. Now, once you see Terabox here, if you do see any options or button here that says update, go ahead and click on it and wait for the update complete. And once the update is complete, you can go ahead and see if that solves the issue. Now, if that doesn't solve the issue, the next thing you want to do here is you want to manage the permissions that is allowed on the Terabox app. Look for Terabox here, press and hold on it. You want to go and click on the eye icon. And from here, what we need to do next is we want to go to app permissions. And from here, you want to scroll down a bit here. And what we need to do is we want to basically manage a few things. So in this case, first is you want to make sure that you actually uh, allow network, but this will actually would depend on your phone. So some may require you or some other devices uh, actually allows you to turn off the internet connectivity or network connectivity in your phone. So you may or may not see it in the app permissions, but if you see it, go ahead and make sure that this actually or network connectivity is allowed. Now, also, you want to go ahead and go to connection method, and you want to make sure that both option Wi-Fi and mobile data is allowed. So once you've enabled then click on OK. Now, another thing that you might want to consider here is you want to go to battery saver here. And instead of using battery saver, you want to go ahead and click on the no restrictions here. And from then on, see if that solves the issue. Now, if none of this actually works, the next thing that we could do here is to basically reset our network. Now, just a quick note here, if you try doing this next method here, this will actually clear any connections that you have. Like for example, if you've paired a Bluetooth or paired it with a Wi-Fi connection or a Wi-Fi uh, location, it will actually uh, delete that. So just keep that in mind. You may need to reset or uh, set them again if that's the case. So you wanna go to settings here and wanna look for more connectivity options. And from here, you wanna scroll down a bit here and look for the options as reset Wi-Fi, mobile networks, and Bluetooth. Once you click on it, go ahead and click on reset settings. And from here, you just need to enter your PIN to confirm that you wanna reset. And once you've done that, that will actually initiate the reset process. Now again, like what I said before, this will clear any data that you have on your Wi-Fi, your mobile data, and your Bluetooth. So make sure that you know all your uh, data that you want to set reset. Again, like your Wi-Fi password, any uh, Bluetooth device you want to connect, make sure you have them still. But yeah, so in this case, that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.